Hi guys, so here is how you can install Windows on an external hard disk and make it a portable Windows to go. Now to make a portable Windows, we need to download some softwares. So for that, open your browser. So first let's download the Windows OS. Simply Google Download Windows 11. This is the official website, click on it, scroll down. And here, we will be downloading the ISO file. Download now. Now select the edition. This is the one. And download now. Choose the language. And confirm. And download the 64-bit. File size is quite big, it's about 5.4 GB. I will cancel this because I have already downloaded this. Anyway, after downloading this, we will also be downloading Rufus. So, Google Rufus. So, here is the official website. Click on it. You can use the setup file but I would like to use the portable one so that I don't have to install this. Anyway, so it is a very small software, only 1.6 MB. So this is done. So in folder, here is it. I will cut it to the desktop. So we only need Windows OS and Rufus. After this is done, let me quickly insert the hard disk so my hard disk is the E drive. Please make sure to back up everything from this drive as everything will be formatted. Now open this Rufus. I will say no. Here is the Rufus interface. Now in here, select the ISO we downloaded earlier. Select. The file is in the desktop. This is the one. This will take some time. It is scanning. And now it's ready. Make sure you choose the correct drive. This is the only drive here. This one is the ISO file. And in image option, choose Windows to go as we are making it portable. On the partition, choose as per your hard disk. To find this, go to start menu and type disk management. And you will find this, open it. And here is the hard disk. Right click on it and click on properties and go to volumes and you can see the partition style is GPT so it is GPT on target system choose as per your bias usually UEFI now leave everything to default and click on start please choose the same windows you have so this one is windows home so we'll take this and ok so this option will allow you to whether access the system drive or not. Meaning, using portable windows, you can also access the files and copy files from it. But I do not want to access it as I want it to be completely independent. So we'll take this option and OK. Now this will format the drive. All files will be lost. Make sure to back it up. And it is working. So this is now ready. Let me close this. And Rufus make these files, you can actually delete them. Now after this is done, simply restart your computer. Now we need to go to the boot option menu. For my Dell XPS, we need to press F12, but each computer will have a different settings. Some could be using F1, F2, F10 or delete, so press accordingly. Now choose the hard disk USB to boot from. This is the one. Your PC may restart few times. Choose a country or region. Choose a keyboard layout. 
connect to the Wi-Fi next your PC will restart couple of times accept the terms give any device name you want Now sign in with your Microsoft account. If you do not have it, simply create one. Now create PIN. Enter your PIN. For these options, you can choose accordingly. I usually like to turn off all of these settings, except I will skip this, not now, I'll skip this too, I will decline Microsoft 365, decline and next, skip this for now, now it's almost ready. Please note this whole process can take up to 45 minutes to an hour. So we are running these windows from our hard disk. And you will see this on the C drive. This is our hard disk. And now we have portable windows. And this works all great. Thank you very much.